Okay, everyone. Today is September 25th, 2014. You will have to pardon the background noise. Um, we have a, a litter of Old English Sheepdogs that are almost eight weeks old, and when they hear my voice, they want to voice their objection that they are not the center of attention, so and they're only two boxes over, so that's what you hear in the background. As for this litter, this is a litter born August 30th, 2014. It's a litter of Sheepadoodles out of Ruthie and Dustin. Not a planned litter. A lot of people that uh, have been on our website know Dustin's history. Um, we hope that we now have him contained, but he's a pretty determined little boy. Anyhow, but he does make beautiful puppies, even if not on our schedule. But, uh, we do hope that um, we can have him abide by our schedule here in the future. But nonetheless, this is a litter of 10 beautiful sheepadoodles. Uh, both parents are AKC registered, both Dustin. Dustin is a silver and white standard poodle. And uh, Ruthie, of course, is an old English sheepdog. AKC registered, full pedigrees on file for both dogs. This is Law Padoodle Canine Manor. L A W P D O O D L E Canine. M A N O R, Canine Manor. Dot com is our website for additional information. And uh, we took still photos of these guys a couple of days ago. We do have an ongoing reservation list. I tried to add a little bit more explanation on that page today in order to try to make people understand our process and our policy for reservations and choosing puppies. And uh, we do expect that the selection process will begin, if it hasn't already, for these puppies, along with powders that I will be featuring later on. Okay. Uh, meanwhile, I'm going to try to quickly introduce each one uh, individually. And guys, you know to go pee pee in the potty box. Sometimes they get a little bit confused with mom because she comes in and actually jumps into the potty box and nurses them. But she also uses it out of a potty box. So anyway, but uh, once they're weaned, it becomes much less confusing, and the potties the, the puppies do gravitate to the potty box. All right. I'm sorry. It's really even hard for me to think and talk over that noise. <laughs> That's 11 old English sheepdogs over there right now, voicing their objections. So you can imagine the, the volume of the uh, the level of the noise and the barking. Okay. Uh, let's see. Right here we have Ellen. Um, of course, our theme on this was comedians. And in kind of uh, follow-up to our tribute to Robin Williams and, of course, Joan Rivers as well. Um, we did name one of these puppies Joan, and we'll feature her here in a minute. Uh, the day that I named these puppies was actually the day that she passed away. So, uh, prayers to her family. All right, let's see. We'll keep on moving. Uh, this little orange one... Well, I can't read it because it's too high up. And guys, stay off my book, okay? That's actually Joan right here. It's almost as if she heard me call her name. Now, I do apologize for their dirtiness. They just got done having their mushy breakfast, and they tend to get a lot of it all over them as much as they do in their mouth. Now they're getting noisy. Oh, I caught them at a good time. This, this litter still sleeps a lot, so I'm glad to see they're active and speaking and uh, moving around so you all can see them. Let's see, this is our dark blue guy. And this is the one we call Gallagher. I actually think he might be chosen today. Okay, so this is Gallagher. Um, this is Ellen again. Oh, dark green. All right, the dark green guy, this is Jimmy, right here. Whoever one is your favorite, Jimmy Fallon or Jimmy Kimmel. I don't know much about Jimmy Kimmel, but I do love Jimmy Fallon. He's funny. Okay. Uh, oh, look at the markings on your ear there, baby. Who are you? Oh, I think this is our new collar girl. And this is the one we call Phyllis. She's got beautiful markings, as you can see. I just love the spotted ears, the mixed color on the ears. And that's what she had, and that's what I was looking at. There's a little bit of a close-up for her. 
had some camera issues yesterday. Had to run up to an emergency run an hour north of here to Morgantown. Got to visit with my daughter, though, so that was kind of a pleasant surprise on planned visit. Um, but our still camera, it's the camera is okay. My charger died, and I haven't been able to find a replacement um, that I trust to order online. And uh, so there, and then the battery followed up by going dead without a charger. I couldn't charge the battery. But we needed uh, a little bit better technology in our camera anyway, and also kind of pre-planning for hopefully our cruise next summer, which will be our first vacation, real vacation in eight years. So, um, who is this guy? Oh, this is our purple girl. She's also got beautiful markings that I'm trying to observe through the viewfinder. And let's see, purple is the one we call Lucy. See, my mom grew up in Lucy's childhood town. And it's all around New York. Of course, Jamestown, New York, or the next the big city next door takes credit for a lot of Lucy and they have celebrations every year. So this is Lucy. Okay. Uh, let's see, who's this? Who's this? This is, I think, our no-collar girl. Yeah, this is our no-collar girl that we looked at earlier, which is the one we call Phyllis. I know I haven't. Oh, here's our light green boy. Okay, this is the one that we call Foster, as in Foster Brooks. He cracked me up when I was a kid. I used to sometimes watch the Dean Martin comedy hour when I was little and or younger, and... Uh, Foster Brooks was a regular on there. He just cracked me up. There's a joke he told about Joe Namath that still sticks in my mind that's so hysterical. But I guess you had to be there. Uh, dark green. This was Jimmy. Oh, I know. Here's light blue. Another one of our boys. And this is Ray, as in Ray Stevens. We had a v VHS of him um, when my kids were younger. And my son it did all but wear that VHS tape out. It was hysterical. But I love Ray Stevens. Okay, and this is our pink girl. She's actually the smallest girl in our litter. And her name is Carol, as in Carol Burnett. Okay, and let's see, yellow. Did we do yellow yet? No, I don't think we did. This is Whoopi, as in Whoopi Goldberg. Excuse me, Goldberg. Goldberg. Good grief. Whoopi Goldberg. We'll get that. We'll just call her Whoopi and <laughs> be done with it. She's one of our bigger puppies, and you can see she goes a waddling off. Oh, let's see. I just want to make sure I didn't forget anybody. Dark blue, light blue, light green, dark green, yellow, orange, purple, pink. Oh, uh, let's see. I think we got them all. And considering the background uh, that I have to deal with right now, I think we're going to cut this a little short. Um, I hope for everybody that's considering picking out or picking their puppy that uh, this was somewhat of a help. Some may prefer the sound of puppies in the background than to me, so at least you got to meet the puppies. There we go. That's light blue. He was Ray. He's one of our smaller ones, too. Got a lot of really pretty mask on his face. Okay. And once again, this is Law Padoodle Canine Manor, formerly known as Law Padoodle Kennel. Uh, we are located in West Virginia, and you can also email us at lpdk10608 at gmail.com for additional information, and we thank you for observing and watching our puppies with us, and hearing our puppies with us, and may God bless you.